Hello everyone, this is Melanie from Melanie B's Creative Studio and I have a diamond painting for you today. This one is so beautiful, so colorful, and it's from a company called ColorfulDIY.com and they had reached out to me because apparently, I don't know, I'm feeling kind of popular. <laughs> I feel like the popular girl in school. I've never never really you know, kind of um, pushed for that. So here's a little story time with Melanie. In middle school and high school, I never really cared about being a popular girl. I was one of those that was popular and didn't know I was popular because <laughs> it got along with everybody from what was considered like the most popular group to the least popular from everybody in between. <laughs> I had no idea as I got older that everybody knew who I was. So it's kind of one of those things that was like, oh, you remember me? And I'd see people out in public and they're like, hey Mel. And I'm like, hey, how do you know me? You know, I never had any clue that people knew who I was. So that was interesting to me. And so now I felt like that again. I'm like, how do y'all know me? When they, when they email me and say, hey, we've seen your videos. We'd love to have you try our products. And I'm kind of sitting there kind of, I don't know if it's humbling or what, but it's like, really? How, how did you know me? How, you, how did you find me? I mean, I know I'm on YouTube and Google and stuff, but I don't know. It just kind of sets you back a little bit and you go, wow, someone in Romania has found my YouTube videos and wants me to try their product or somebody in Australia wants me to, you know, I mean, it's, it's, it's a very cool experience. I'm in the upstate of South Carolina, you know, and <laughs> living on 250 acres in the middle of nowhere. And it's like, that is a pretty cool thing to have happen. So I'm always very humbled when somebody reaches out to me. So it's been happening quite a lot lately. As you've noticed, there's been a lot of collaborations and I feel like that is such a huge blessing because you can only purchase so much out of your own pocket before you start to realize my budget is going out the window. And so at some point you have to make a little money or you can't justify what you're doing anymore. And that's where I was. And so I feel like the timing was right for me to get some of these kits for free or, you know, be able to say, okay, well, I'm doing this for review. So I really appreciate those people who reach out to me and say, please, you know, test our product. Plus it makes me feel like they really value my feedback. So I, I, just, I just really appreciate it. So enough about that. This company reached out to me because they have diamond paintings and stamped cross stitch kits and a couple of other things in their store and they'd seen my videos and because I do lots of different types of kits and projects, they wanted me to try a couple other things. So I selected a diamond painting kit and a printed cross stitch kit. And you guys, I'm doing those in separate videos because they're both gorgeous and they're both totally different so that's what we're gonna do today i'm bringing you today the diamond painting kit and this one is going to look like this you guys are going to see this and know exactly why i chose it it is so whimsical bright colored fabulous i mean like the colors are incredible um, so don't y'all wish I could like sing, like, don't y'all wish I could carry a tune in a bucket? Cause that <laughs> was probably painful and no, I'm not going to edit it out. Cause, cause part of what is fun in my <laughs> channel is that I can torture people with my story times and my voice, <laughs> especially when I'm hoarse and I've been suffering with pollen allergies and stuff and I'm losing it really fast. Probably cause I just did that. Isn't it the cutest thing you've ever seen? Like these colors. You guys, I don't make commission off of most of the stuff I bring you. I just get so much joy out of the colors and the design and all the like sailboats and arr, that I have to share it with you. So yeah, I don't make money <laughs> off of like you buying this kit, but I just, I had to share it because it's just fabulous. It's so freaking fabulous. All right. So this particular one is a 50 by 50 centimeter and that is going to be this size in inches and it's also going to have a schematic on the left which is a 24 color vibrant vibrant color piece it's also going to have a schematic on the right which i can't push it up far enough let's go right here right here and you guys like oh my gosh i get all these beauties and i'm like how many hours in my life do i need i need to take a month off i need to just like power through 
20 videos and then just record them, edit them, I get them uploaded and get them ready and then just like take a month off and do nothing but projects and like maybe some housework. I don't know, maybe a dish or two. But would that not be the most ideal scenario and take a cruise? I think we need to try to come up with a paint my number, diamond painting, whatever hobby related cruise. I am going to have somebody, somebody who's watching this video right now, I'm going to challenge you to get the information that it would take to set up a cruise for me to, to actually for me to set up a cruise for us to do that for, let's say, I don't know what, 250, 300 people to be able to go on. Uh, what would it, what would I have to do? Um, I know COVID regulations and all would probably put a big damper on that this year. We'd have to work it out for another year or two, but either way. Okay, moving on. <laughs> I digress. Okay, let's look. First of all, poured canvas. Let's take a look at the tack. I think it's pretty strong. What do you think? It looks pretty strong. I mean, all it has to hold is a sticky little drill, like a little plastic drill, and it held my finger, which, you know, we ain't going to talk about how much my fingers weigh. Especially as puffy as they are right now with all this retention. I just need, we, we just need to take a look. We just need to take a look at these little tiny chiclet <laughs> drills. Oh my god. Oh my god, the colors. The colors. Okay. Cranberry reds, purples, aqua blues, deep purple, green. Okay, I don't even know. Let's turn it this way. That would be more logical. And I'm on this background here. Crinkle, crinkle, crinkle. Look at the colors. Now, some of the mustardy greens and stuff may not do it for me, but still, I mean, there's a lot of warm colors in here too, but look, oh my gosh. Oh my God. And then the blues. The blues. Okay. Now, on the front, it is numbered with its corresponding schematic. I came, schematic. It's corresponding schematic number. Let's get our little canvas back up here. I tossed it <laughs> out of the way. So, example number one. I got it upside down. Of course I do. Let's just cut number one off so I can just not have to rotate this whole thing. So, number one is this delicious code S, number 150. I should have enough in this bag to do all of the number ones on my entire piece. Oh my gosh, y'all. These are just gorgeous. Oh, and I didn't mention, okay, round drill. So it's a little quicker process than what we normally would have, right? With a square drill, more sparkle, but a little less detail maybe, but not in a 50 by 50. I feel like a 50 by 50 centimeter is gonna give us plenty of detail. It's a whimsical piece. I'm just so excited about this freaking piece. And I, you know, I don't even know what this one cost. Let me go look. And I also didn't mention, they shipped this on May the 9th, and I received it on May 29th. So it took 20 days to receive it from China. And I didn't think that was too bad considering I've noticed some really extreme delays again with shipping. I know that my local post office is so short of help that they're closed every day, except from the hours of three to four. So those of you who've been placing a lot of orders in my, my online store lately, you've noticed that it's taking me longer to get packages out. That's because when I go to ship, there's only one hour of the day that they're actually taking those orders and able to process them. Now, that is the closest post office to me. And my husband and I share a car. So when he goes to work and he's working about six days a week now, he's dropping them off at the post office that's on the way. So we don't have an option to go to a different post office. But that's just an example of why there are so many delays right now with the shipping system, especially in the U.S. I'm sure the other countries that are in lockdown, again, are struggling the same way. So for a little bit less than three weeks, I don't think that's too bad. So this particular painting was $10.50. So for those of you who are diamond painters, I'm just going to tell you, I'm not as selective about my diamond paintings as I am I paint my numbers because paints for a painting kit are a lot different than diamond painting quality. But now, if it passed the test for me for adhesion, which has to be super tack, super strong, and for drill quality, then I am sold. And for 1050, you've gotta be kidding me. <laughs> 
So I'm like super sold. Now I am gonna do a little test area real quick. Uh, I'm gonna finish this video up and we're gonna go to that beautiful printed stamped cross stitch kit that you're gonna be like, what? You're gonna kill me is what you're gonna do. Please don't, I choose life. Okay, so I'm gonna do this little light blue up in here just because I think it'll be more visible. And I'm gonna get my round drills all straight. It's funny how I can't ever do this right for a video, but I can have this whole thing lined up <laughs> when I'm painting for myself in like two seconds. Now I do see a little junk drill right here. And a junk drill, let me just separate it for a second. Let me get it closer. Let's see if we can focus on that little bad boy. You see how it's got some plastic poo-poo edges? He can't be used. So we're gonna chunk him because he would mess up our placement. There's one junk drill out of that little batch. All right, so let's just peel back this edge, which is just gonna be awkward. My hand's gonna be all over the place because the stickiness is gonna be exposed. But again, I chose this spot and this color just so you can kind of see it. And let's do a little bit of this area. Of course, I picked it up on the side of my freaking tool. All right. It's hard to be efficient when you're working in such an awkward place where you can't put your hand this is not where I'd normally start. So I would have to, I'm like I'm having to stay back further. I'm not being very efficient. I actually have a video on how to diamond paint effectively and efficiently, which I'm not trying to teach you how to be faster. I'm just trying to teach you how to be efficient. So be sure to check that out. It's one of my older videos. So it's not been viewed a lot because I didn't have like super graphics and all that stuff, but go look for that because to me, it's pretty informative, and the people who've watched it have been very complimentary of it. It's just kind of been lost in the, in the group. when I'm doing them fast and at a strange angle, it's funny how I get this little wonky, like beginner's thing going on, but I don't even care. All right, so let's look. I'm gonna take my flashlight, see if you can see the sparkle. All right, first of all, yeah, I need to not, <laughs> I need to not be trying to get all quick about it when I'm video. So that is all you guys. I'm loving this design. It is so much fun, so much whimsy. So my style, like, oh, I love it. Okay, so that's it. ColorfulDIY.com, go check them out. You know, it never hurts to go look. Y'all have better control than me because y'all know I have zero. Be sure to join me on Patreon and in Facebook and, and Instagram and Pinterest and Twitter and whatever. And all that's in the description below along with the link on where you can find this painting and their other diamond paintings. And you guys, thanks as always for watching. I'll see you back soon.